Hello everyone and thank you for joining me in today's webinar. Today we're going to focus on order payments. So for the administrator to look at how many orders are being placed and what payments were made, there's an, a separate page that can be viewed only by the administrator of the website. So of course we all know that if we go under orders and we click on search orders, we can search for any order that's being placed on the website. Now the good thing about the search orders page is that we can see everything from different columns such as order number, customer name, pay status, the shipping status, order status, order date, in, and origination. The origination is simply where the order was being placed or who it was being placed, whether it's by the admin, if it was a specific user going through the enrollment, or if it's a, a user going through the shopping cart. So this is the origination of the order. Now, if we go under orders and we click on order payments, we can see the actual payments of these orders. And this will help you in the long run. So if you want to see what type of payment was made, you can actually see in this column here. So there are several orders that were made by cash, one by credit card. There was one that was made by a payment account for a gateway and others. So of course, you want to change the records per page to the highest and then you can see everything here. Now if you want to view more details of that payment or order, click right on the order number. So I'm going to click on order 20. And then it's going to show you the payment date, the payment amount here. But if you click on the order number, it's going to take you to the order details. And then all you need to do is click here on payment information. And then it's going to show you the payment account, which is credit card the credit or debit card, uh, debit card type, which is a MasterCard or it could be a Visa or American Express or Amex, the payment date and the payment amount. So this will be a very useful tool for you as the administrator because this is just another way of displaying the payments of the actual order. So you can actually see here, instead of just going to the order, edit the order, and then look at the payment amount, you can actually see the payment amount here for each order that's being placed in the system. Okay, so that pretty much wraps the webinar on order payments. I want to thank everyone for joining me in today's webinar, and I hope I provided value for your time. Thank you.